Good morning, everyone, and welcome back to Chris's Auto Restoration Shop. Um, as a lot of followers of the page will know, we've done quite a few Rover SD1s, and guess what? We've got another one. So this car came to us as a running, driving car, uh, just days ago, really. Obviously, we've stripped, bagged and tagged, labelled everything. The engine has gone away back to the customer because he's doing his own thing with his engine and his transmission. So he caringly collected that yesterday. And in the meantime, we've stripped this car, <clears throat> put it on our, uh, our dolly systems that we've got. Uh, oh, incidentally, if you want one of these dolly systems, we make, we make these. The good thing about these is <clears throat> this is the system, obviously, the standard system. So it's a four dolly system, highest quality casters that are braked. And this tube slides up and down the bar. It's removable. There's also a bolt underneath that locks that in place. And then the only thing you have to make is the pocket, uh, you know, the, the piece that sits into this pocket. So for each car, all you have to make is, you know, whatever you need to make to fasten to the car. All this is, is standard stock stuff. So we can make those for you if you need them. Um, <clears throat> We've removed the floor uh, simply because the customer has got for us, get ready, brand new inner sills, brand new outer sills, complete floor, all this floor section, the floor section into the boot, that's all one piece, he's also got the inner and outer rear quarters, the rear panel, the front panel, new wings, so basically, oh, he's even got new legs. Um, so when this car's been to blasting, basically from there, car will be unpicked, surgically dismantled, and everything you see from there backwards will be uh, going in the trash. Uh, so it's essentially going to be a new a new shell. So it's a, <clears throat> it's a 1985 uh, 3.5 litre manual Vitesse. That's the actual model. I'm told this is close to the original colour, but it's it's obviously been repainted at some point. So it will be uh, it will be a dark red. I can't remember what the colour is, but I'll uh, I'll find that out for you on the next one. So that's where we are with this. <clears throat> this is going to be blasted in the next couple of weeks. It would be going sooner. I mean, it's ready now, but uh, our blaster is incredibly busy at the moment. So that's the the next slot that we've actually got available. Some rot there on the uh, bulkhead. It's not too bad. Unfortunately, you can't get these panels anymore, the, the firewall, uh, so that will have to be repaired. But we've done it many times before, and we can uh, we can recreate all that just as it was from the factory. So we're not we're not too worried about that. Good thing about removing stuff before you blast it is our blaster now can get into all these nooks and crannies because we're putting a new uh, front panel on it. There was no, no reason not to take this off. So when it comes back, that will be all super, super clean, which typically, if you weren't removing a panel, you know, that would probably get missed. So that's a, another good thing. If you're not keeping what you need, and as long as it doesn't affect the uh, structural integrity of the car, you might as well take it off for blasting. All right, guys, um, I'll keep up to date with that one on, uh, on the next one. Uh, thanks for joining us again. I'll talk to you soon.